Well, I never expected to do a last minute video using my phone in my bedroom and all of that, but I really wanted to have like a proper sit down because a lot of stuff is really going on in the world right now, and I mean a lot in the UK, but it has been going like that all over the world but in the UK something has happened and if you have watched the news then you would have known about it but I won't go into too much detail if you don't because it's complicated to explain and also I don't really want to scare people and a lot of people I know would be scared enough as it is. So yes I thought that I would just use this opportunity just to have a sit down and a talk to you guys about what's going on. I may not be great at filming with my phone but I just really wanted to share with you guys that you aren't alone and just basically just trying to have a chat together really if that makes sense. But yes, so with the coronavirus situation it's becoming a little bit of a um, spanner in the works within the autism community and to be fair though it is it is quite unexpected and a lot of people over the past few weeks I have read and seen a lot of people about how scared they are and what are they going to do how are they plan things and how upset they are and to be honest it's really really heartbreaking and I can really understand why all these things are happening and something like this it's really hard just to try to figure out what to do because it's something that it can't be solved, it can't be controlled or anything and it is going to go on for quite a while but to be really honest it's it's okay to be scared and it, the reason why it's really okay to be scared because you just don't know what's going to happen like everyone doesn't know what's going to happen but at the end of the day, we're going to be in this together. It's not just me and it's not just my loved ones, but it's everyone. We are going to stay strong and we are going to keep positive and keep spirited. And I don't know how long this is going to last really, to be honest, but hopefully fingers crossed that all will be well and my thoughts and prayers are with everybody all the families friends everybody around the world at this time i wasn't really too sure if i was ready to film this because i was one of the people who was not really 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 ready to film because i'm going to have to just like stay at home for a while really because of a few different reasons because I found out that I'm really likely to catch the coronavirus because I have a weak immune system and asthma and I also got a member of a family who's over 70 so we're doing everything possible to keep our whole family safe and even though I may not see everyone including Jack for a while I may not see all my friends I won't do shopping I won't do all the activities and stuff and probably I might miss my birthday which is in May but to be honest now everyone right now is more important to me than anything else but because I'm a bit scared that doesn't mean I should carry on with my life and I'm gonna do everything possible to make everything as normal I may or may not do a lot of YouTube videos for a while but I'm gonna be doing as many filming as I can World Autism Awareness Week is coming up and it's still going ahead and I will update on what's going to happen during World Autism Awareness Week and then also I might try and see if I can do a few stuff so everything on social media will be normal for now but if anything happens I will let you know and that's all I can really say to be honest because I know that I don't want to panic too much because I don't want you guys to be worried and also I've just got a really sort everything out really and sort the schedule so yes so that is what's going to happen but remember guys 
I know it's not easy and it's a really difficult time but just remember that everything is going to be okay stay safe and stay positive never give up and we will get through this together I know we will 